My tummy time tip is to buy some really like light up bright toys. Um, Cause babies just love it. Like they want to stare at it. And I know we all want to live in this tonal world where everything looks good in our house and toys are wooden, but babies don't care about wooden toys and you'll see the tackier the better. Um, so my tip is to put the toys away and when you're doing tummy time, bring them out and then get super excited to see them. And it encourages them to be on their bellies longer, which is great for their neck and just get real cheesy with it and then put them away. Hey guys, so I was going to just throw up a little story because I learned something today that I thought was really helpful. My bra is showing. Uh, really helpful and um, I wanted to share with you because I felt lucky to learn. Um, we have started feeding May solids and she's a little over four months old and it's a little early but they're recommending uh, starting solids sooner than when I had my last baby. So we did it. She's also our third, so we're kind of just like jumping in. Um, we've tried a lot of fruits and vegetables and she's doing great and loving it. And um, I got a call from my mom yesterday. And she's like, maybe are really red. Do you think she's having a reaction to food that you're feeding her? And um, I love that my mom's finally on Instagram and watching my stories. But I was going to share that teething is really kicking in right now. So she's like, so she has a lot of excess saliva and you'll notice her baby just like drooling all day long. And when they're teething, um, my sleep trainer, Davis, who's, we love you, Davis. Um, she told me that the saliva when they're teething has a lot more acid in it. So May is a belly sleeping baby, which means that she's big enough now to lift her head up and move it around and get comfortable. And she's actually already rolling um, front to back. So she can sleep how she wants in her crib and she's sleeping on her belly, so on her cheek. So she's drooling and then basically sleeping in it. Uh, or like the, you know, the sheet is getting wet with drool and then it's like her cheeks on it. So um, it causes that redness. So don't be alarmed. You can treat it with, you know, salves. Obviously I would do natural type aquaphors, um, things that you like that are like calming and soothing. That's my little hot tip, just to not be worried about allergies, that the redness on their face is uh, normal during this time. And I'm just sharing because even though I've done this three times, I completely forget. And it's not until it's up, you're up against it that you're like, holy hell, what's happening? You know, it's still kind of stressful. So um, the redness on the cheeks, totally normal. <laughs>